Are you looking to root Samsung Galaxy S7 Edge International variant? You've come to the right place. Here you will learn how to root this phone and install TWRP custom recovery. Once you have rooted Samsung's latest phone, you can easily install custom firmware and root apps of your choice. To root Samsung Galaxy S7 Edge, you simply need to unlock its bootloader so that you can flash TWRP. Once done, your phone will be rooted successfully. However, there are a few things you should consider before you proceed. Only try this method on Samsung Galaxy S7 Edge International variant. If you have another variant of this phone, you can't root it using this method. To root Samsung Galaxy S7 Edge using this method, you need to take responsibility for anything that might happen to your phone. Sometimes, you might make a mistake and end up with a dead phone. We do not take responsibility for dead or broken or bricked phones. Always start rooting procedure after charging your phone battery. Root Samsung Galaxy S7 Edge, the procedure. So now that you've decided to root Samsung Galaxy S7 Edge International variant, it's time to start the procedure. Let's begin by downloading some tools. Be sure to follow steps. Preparing to root Samsung Galaxy S7 Edge International variant. 1. Download Samsung S7 official firmware. You will need this file in case something goes wrong and you want to go back to the original firmware, untouched and unrooted. 2. Now make a backup of all your important files stored on your phone. 3. Download Odin. You need this tool to root Samsung Galaxy S7 Edge. 4. Download USB drivers for Samsung. 5. Download TWRP custom recovery for Samsung S7 Edge. 6. Download opt encrypt zip file. 7. Download Super Sue. Now that you've downloaded all the tools we need to root the phone, it's time to start the procedure. One, extract Odin file. You will find an executable file inside. Run it to install the tool on a PC. Two, locate AP and hit browse when Odin runs. When asked for path, provide path to TWRP file that you downloaded earlier. Three. Now press start and wait for TWRP to be flashed on your phone. 4. Once completed, go to custom recovery by using the hardware key combination. 5. Once in recovery, look for wipe and format data options. Clear all the data. 6. Now reboot the phone in recovery. You will find the option to do so on TWRP options. 7. While inside the recovery, transfer the file opt encrypt zip to your phone. 8. Now move the Super Sue file to your phone. 9. Now install both these files using TWRP. 10. Reboot your phone. 